In this short video, we are going to learn about how to include complex numbers as data files in ComSol Multiphysics. In order to include complex number as data files, we need to go to definition. We have to right click there. We'll get an option functions. Under functions, we'll be choosing the option interpolation. I click here. One node will be added and then we have to go to the setting window and in the setting window in the data source there are multiple options from the drop down we need to choose the option file once we choose the option file we will be getting an option of browse we click there going to the right folder i have already in my right folder so what i have done is i have stored the data in text file and I have separated the real and imaginary part like this particular part is the real part of the data so I include this and then I plot it so one more thing you have to understand and that is you can define uh, an unit to this particular data say I define this unit as say Newton say this is the unit of force and the column argument means this data is defined against certain coordinate and that is say x coordinate and the unit of x coordinate might be meter and that's why I am putting meter. Based on your circumstances, you can choose different option. After that, if I plot, you can see the unit is being shown here and also the unit of x, it, it is in meter. If you change it to centimeter, then it will be shown in centimeter. Similarly, you can choose it. Now for the imaginary part, again, we'll be right click on the definition. We'll be going to the interpolation option and we'll be choosing the file, browsing the right file, uh, the imaginary part and again plotting it. And you can define the units as before, say Newton and centimeter and then you can plot it like this. Now we have added the real and imaginary part. Now what you need to do, you need to go to the definition, take the variable table. Suppose I want to define my complex number as complex and the expression would be int 1 comma x plus 1 i. 1 i indicates the imaginary i into int 2 comma x. So if you see this has been taken as Newton. So, but this particular thing is a complex number. So thereby you can include complex number from the initial data files and sometimes these are necessary and hope this video was helpful for you. Thank you.